Hello, and welcome to another Mimosa overview video. Today, we're going to be going over the design tool. When designing point-to-point -point links and point-to-multipoint -point networks, using Google Earth to do manual design, it can be a little difficult. You don't know how high to mount the radios. You're not exactly sure which way to point the antennas. You don't know for sure if there's terrain in the way. You especially don't know what the expected signal strength will be. You don't know what kind of performance to expect from the link. You're not sure about rain fade and you don't know exactly how many subscribers you can cover. So this is where the Mimosa design tool can come in and help you create your point-to-point -point links and your point-to-multipoint networks. Okay, so I'm gonna pull up our first link here and uh, scroll down here to the bottom. You can see that this link has a Fresnel obstruction. And then when we pull up our other link, you can see that it's a clear line of sight. You have all the data here for the link rain and shine. And so we have a working link here and we have an access point on this tower that I want to show you. So we're trying to cover this subdivision right here and being up on the first tower would cover it just as well but the second tower that has line of sight back to our first tower is perfect because it covers all of this area. And real quick here if you click in the coverage it'll give you an overview of using a C5, a C5C with a 25 dBi dish and a C5 with a 30 dBi dish. Also covered with the MCS7 coverage plot down here at the bottom left of the map. When creating a B11 link in the design tool, it'll also give you the availability to see FCC frequencies in the area. For this, it will show you 11 gigahertz links that might be located near where you're wanting to put your point-to-point -point link. This will give you a better idea if B11 is the right fit for you. You can see your stats here in the top right hand corner of the screen. Top left is Fresnel zone obstructions. And then if you come down here to the bottom, it'll tell you the elevation, the height of the radio, the tilt for both sides, and then which direction you should point both radios. So the Mimosa design tool is an effective way to plan your point-to-point -point links and your point-to-multi-point -point -point networks. Keep in mind that the design tool does not take into account buildings or any type of foliage that might be in the way of your link. If you have any questions or design concerns, please feel free to reach out to our support team. You can do this by going to mimosa.co and opening up a support chat window.